15 common insulin resistance symptoms you can easily tell. Insulin resistance is an incredibly common condition, affecting an astonishing 50% of people around the world. It becomes even more relevant to those with pre-diabetic or diabetic conditions, which usually come hand in hand with insulin resistance, right? While the insulin resistance can have it as complications such as increased risk of stroke, heart attack, and other metabolic problems, it can also be managed properly through the lifestyle changes, through the things we discuss in this channel, holistic supplements we have at sugarmds.com, right? But let's talk about the signs. How do you know that you're insulin resistant? Number one, most insulin resistant people will have belly fat, not everyone, right? But if you have been noticing some extra junk in the trunk lately, there is uh, more to it than just not eating your veggies. It could be insulin resistance kicking in too. Belly fat is a big indicator whether or not insulin is doing its job of shuttling glucose into cells for energy. If for some reason your cells become resistant to that action, the body generates more insulin to compensate, which leads to increased storage of fat, and typically that is in your midsection. In other words, the extra baggage you have been packing around could be about signs, not snacks. Number two, puffiness. Now, puffy eyes and puffy hands can make you look like you just cried for hours, but unfortunately, this is more of an indicator that your body may be holding onto water, then it is a sign of an emotional breakdown, right? Water retention is often caused by insulin resistance. When the body cannot process glucose properly due to hormonal imbalance, the excess of sugar in the bloodstream causes cells to hang on to more water. Number three, frequent urination. If you are starting to feel like your body is becoming less responsive to the insulin medication, that you are getting insulin resistant, without insulin you are gaining weight, you have noticed inexplicable weight gain you may want to investigate the signs of insulin resistance, right? Fortunately, one of the signs that you can easily identify yourself without medical testing is what? Excessive urination, right? So a lot of people ask, why can I not stay asleep? Well, if frequent nighttime urination is keeping you from getting those precious sleep, it could be insulin resistance. It is an insidious condition that robs your mind and body of rest and relaxation, with consequences far worse than a few yawns during your next meeting. Number four is foggy mind. Now, life can get foggy at times, that is true literally and metaphorically too, but brain fog is a real thing and it can be frustrating to suffer from poor focus. The good news is that the brain fog may actually be insulin resistant symptom, meaning that there are tangible steps you can take to reduce its intensity. For example, by eating well, getting regular exercise, and taking the time to unplug from technology, your chances of restoring clearly skyrocket. Next, five, low testosterone, like a double-edged sword, leaving you feeling tired and grumpy, right? Not only does it make men sluggish, but it also can be an insulin resistance symptom, which can lead to more dangerous conditions like diabetes. Most of the time, diabetic people have low testosterone. It's, the opposite is not true. You know, most people think that the low testosterone people have diabetes, but actually diabetes induces low testosterone. Sure, some people might think it is just a few extra cuddles each night. Who cares, right? Not so fast. Low testosterone has been linked to metabolic problems in the body that require more than just a hug to resolve. Number six, slow metabolism. If you often feel like it is impossible to achieve your weight loss goals, a slow metabolism might be the culprit. Weight loss can be hard, and insulin resistance is one of its most notorious roadblocks. Well, thankfully, SugarMD Fat Burner is there to help you, right? 
Not only does this natural supplement include compounds that actually help reverse the insulin resistance, but it also works with your body to keep you burning the fat and reaching your fitness ambitions. Number seven, sleep apnea. Sleep apnea is so common these days that you almost need a snore badge of honor to distinguish yourself from the sufferers. But beyond showing off your peaceful sleeping, apnea actually has serious implications for insulin resistance. It is not uncommon for insulin resistant folks to show signs of sleep apnea, making it important to be aware of the detrimental impact that lack of quality sleep can have on your overall health. So if you want to reduce insulin resistance symptoms and stay healthy, it is time to get serious about getting some quality shot eye. Number eight, inflammation, pain, and all those itis-related sufferings are nothing to laugh about. Insulin resistance symptoms can add fuel to the fire too, and when it is related to all kinds of stiffness in your joints, you may call it arthritis, bursitis, tendonitis, whatever, it can put a damper on your day for sure. But you don't have to let inflammation rule you. There are lots of natural remedies that can help make it more manageable and get you going again. I would say consider using sugar MD advanced glucose support, especially when you are diabetic, which will lower your insulin resistance and lower your joint pains thanks to its very strong curcumin content. Number nine, skin tags have long been a mystery, right? And some people tend to ignore them as an aesthetic issue or try to hide them. But as it turns out, skin tags could actually be a sign of insulin resistance. That means if you have skin tags growing on your body, you may need to watch your sugar consumption and your insulin resistance more carefully. Number 10, cysts in your body like baker's cysts. Well, a baker's cyst may sound like an artisanal pastry that can only be found in the finest bakeries, but in reality, it is a collection of fluid behind the knee. While such cysts may arise from various circumstances, their number could also be a symptom of insulin resistance. So yeah, insulin resistance symptoms are no picnic. So if you feel like you're facing an endless onslaught of cysts, it might be time to discuss with your doctor and get evaluated for insulin resistance. Number 11, acantosis. Have you ever noticed those dark folds on your back of your neck, armpits, or groin? What sound like a simple velvet texture might actually be something more serious. This dim discoloration is known as acantosis nigricans, and it can be an indication of insulin resistance. While many people ignore this condition, it is important to pay attention to it since insulin resistance can lead to diabetes, and other medical issues if left untreated. Almost there, number 12, exercise intolerance. If you find yourself out of breath and tired from physical activity faster than ever, then your body may be trying to tell you something. This could be an indication of insulin resistance and maybe even heart issues already. An insulin disorder where the body has difficulty properly metabolizing glucose, so your muscles are suffering, including your heart. It's important to listen to your body and take appropriate measures, such as seeing your doctor, watching more Sugar MD channel, right? Number 13, carb cravings. When they say you are what you eat, I think that in my case, or in your case, it will be more appropriate to say you are what you crave. If my carbohydrate cravings had a face, it would be a collage of all the delicious breads, pasta, cereal, crackers, and biscuits, and waffles, and pancakes, and muffins, everything, right? Well, unfortunately, all those delicious treats also mean insulin resistance for you. And for me too, if I'm craving, I'm insulin resistant. Something I have to keep an eye on with regular exercise, healthy meal choices, and eventually those will disappear. For now, 
I am content indulging in these healthy goodness that I keep talking in my YouTube channel all the time. So keep watching. Number 14, not being satisfied with a meal, no matter what you eat. What an infuriating feeling to put in all this effort of eating a hearty meal only to come away feeling like you are still missing something. Unfortunately, insulin resistance is partly responsible for this maddening experience. When insulin resistance is present, it is actually difficult for the cells to pull in nutrition from your body, from your food. Even though on a full stomach you feel far from hungry, that doesn't mean your body isn't starved of essential nutrients. Insulin resistance does a pretty convincing job at making it seem like it is perpetually 5 o'clock and dinner time. What this means is that you need more substantial snacks than the normal person between the meals and throughout the day. And we always recommend actually not to have snacks because there's no point of having snacks unless you are exercising day in and day out and all day long, right? So if you are in need of a 11 a.m. snack or a midnight feast, now you know why. And I hope you know what to do about it. 15, and the last one, afternoon drowsiness or the fatigue, right? Afternoon drowsiness may feel like it's a natural part of your life, but if you find yourself needing a nap after every meal, especially after lunch, then you might be falling victim to the plague of insulin resistance. Insulin resistance is caused by a wide variety of factors anything from your hormones, your genetics, to what you eat, and how often you eat, and how you exercise, etc. So cut down on the sugar snacks, right? Get out and walk around a few times a day. There's no need to worry about sneaking off for another afternoon nap in that case. All right, well, we covered 15 symptoms of insulin resistance. I hope you learned something today. If you did, please give a thumbs up. Please share this video. And if you are not a subscriber, what are you waiting for? Do it. It's just one click away. Talk to you later. Hey guys, I hope you are enjoying this channel so far and I hope you subscribed already. If you didn't, do it. And if you did, watch this video right there. I think that will help you too.